Okay, so today I took out the uh, drywall, all except for the top section there. The uh, door casing will go that high. I've got this out. I'll pull the 2x4 out of the bottom down there and this, cut it to height. This is not a uh, this is not a support wall, so there's no problem with taking that 2x4 out. That's the support wall there. And I've started getting the casing out. I took this off of this side. I'll take the top one out tomorrow and this one out tomorrow. Put them in over there. Then I'll use this to go in this hole. To fill that in and just uh, transfer the uh, the wood over and I'll have to get some maybe some drywall because there is drywall here and then the uh, and then the the paneling so uh, I'll have to do that on both sides. Pretty sure there's no, there's no, there's no drywall on this side. Only on the bedroom side. Hmm, interesting. So, I'll, I'll, whatever we put in this side. And we've got to enclose, I'll enclose this. I'm taking this section, that drawer right there, that shelf. If I can get this over. Uh, that shelf from there to there is 13 inches. Curiously enough, it works out because that's how low that piece of drywall goes. 13 inches down, the door will, the top of the door will be at 13 inches. And, <clears throat> excuse me, so we'll have a shelf right there and then the walkthrough. I'll put paneling on it either side of this. It's coming along. I should have the door switched tomorrow. You're kidding me. <laughs>